They say a mother knows best. Um, excuse me? Oh, hi. Do you have a bigger size? And today, no one can tell Michelle otherwise. Is there a problem? No, she just needs a bigger size. No, she doesn't. Despite Amanda's protest. Yes, I do, Mom. It's really uncomfortable. Come out here, Amanda. Let's take a look. She doesn't budge. See? It's too tight. If you saw a mother. Right now it is. Publicly shaming her daughter into losing weight. You are going to look so beautiful when you lose those extra pounds. What would you do? You might be wondering what film scene inspired this scenario. I think you're going to have to lose that extra weight we talked about. Well, pay close attention. Excellent. This is it. As the action unfolds at Hazel Boutique in Ramsey, New Jersey, you might hear a clue or three to help identify the movie. Stay tuned for the answer. This is what we've spoken about, about you losing the weight. So this can be your inspiration dress. But first, our young actress, Amanda, is fully prepared for Michelle's hurtful words. But I don't think I need to lose the weight. While they leave this customer clearly concerned. Don't you want that summer body? But I don't feel comfortable. But will she come to Amanda's defense? You need to lose weight first, OK? I'm just trying to motivate you. I think that you look great. And if you don't like this dress, then I think maybe we should put another dress. This would be what I was thinking is a good inspiration dress for her to lose a few pounds. She tries to warn Michelle about the weight of her words. We don't want her to have bad body image issues, you know what I mean? I want her to be skinny. I don't think necessarily wanting to be skinny is a goal, but wanting to feel comfortable. When her attempts to reason go unheeded... She looks too heavy for this. But it doesn't close right. Yes, hold on, I'm gonna find something for you. She takes matters into her own hands. I just don't feel comfortable in this dress. That's okay. I'm gonna okay. find a dress that looks nice first, okay? And together, they search for a bigger, more comfortable dress. Awesome. This looks really pretty. Yeah. I think that would look so good on you. While we approach from behind. Hi there, how are you? Hi. I'm Jan Quinones. Hi. It's What Would You Do? Oh, I've seen the show before. <laughs> do you ever see the movie? No, I haven't. No, there was a scene in it where this happens. Oh, and okay. uh, her housekeeper uh, lets out the dress. What were you going to do? I was going to try and find another dress. Maybe you could change mom's opinion. And it fit better, right? Eh? Yeah, I know. Because, you know, I've done that before where I try to find the, <laughs> the dress that'll make me lose weight, and it doesn't work because you don't want to have to change yourself. As the day goes on... I think you would look great in that. Yeah. Thank yeah, you. Sure. We see young women go out of their way to boost Amanda's confidence. Especially since it's mom who's bringing her down. Doesn't it look good on her? I mean, if she lost a few pounds. Yeah. No, I think it's nice. I mean, it's supposed to be a tight fitting dress. Mm -hmm. I just think we should be a little more positive, you know? Yeah, I, I was just telling her, you know, this would be a good inspiration for her. I think you should just have fun. Okay. Don't worry about it. You'll be beautiful no matter what, I promise. With Michelle clearly unmoved. Honey, I'm going to find you a smaller size. I'll be right back. This customer tells Amanda it's not her load to bear. You should not worry about any of that at your age. Thank you. Beautiful. Okay, we got another good one. I think you're perfect the way you are. Perfect. She's perfect. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> Didn't mean to scare you. Oh it's what would you do? Yeah, I know. Oh my god. I'm like shaking. I was so upset. It's amazing. You step right in and you try to comfort her. You try to give her positive. She's beautiful. She doesn't need to be wearing a bat at this age. She should wear whatever makes her comfortable. There's a movie called oh, it's Adam Sandler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember when the mom does the same thing to her daughter? Mm -hmm. What does that do to a young girl? It really messes with her. I think we need to uplift young girls, especially like now is the time. These next customers aren't even old enough to vote. Like she doesn't have to be skinny to feel pretty. 
but they make it clear who they side with. I think telling her she needs to lose weight and needs to be skinnier might promote an eating disorder, and I don't think you should say that to her. But I'm just trying to motivate her. We could be depressed, but we're skinny. That doesn't mean anything. As the day winds down, there's no shortage of fellow teens rallying around Amanda. You look so pretty. Look so pretty. I pretty. love that dress. Thank you. Thank you. Helping her pick out clothes. Did this girl feel nice? Uh, no. No? Don't spend it in because yeah. if you are confident, you will look pretty in anything you wear. But nothing could prepare us for this mom. I can't fit this over my head. It's too uncomfortable. Well, then you know what you need to do. What? Not eat so much. Oh, I'm sorry. She's <sighs> telling you that she's not comfortable, so find something that you're comfortable with. Okay, sweetie? That's... that's... Oh, I'm just trying to motivate. Oh, yeah, that's not so the way you messed up. That's not the way you motivate a child, okay? So. Come on, let's be tough. Maybe you should mind your own business. Maybe you should mind your own business. Oh, I really, when I hear something like that, it really upsets me. You have a beautiful daughter. But she, she is. could be more beautiful. No, no, no. she couldn't. It's about what's inside here. It's not about what you see on the outside. We all come in different shapes and sizes, and I'm so angry right now. I can't even begin to tell you. Time to tell her this whole scene it's okay, man. Oh <laughs> is a ruse. I'm so happy that you're here right now because I was getting so upset. I can tell, I can tell. I just couldn't, I couldn't stand by. As a mom, how do you handle it? You know, no child's perfect, but you encourage them to do the best they can. Set an example, model behavior, but don't shame. Shaming is the worst thing you can do. But that's exactly what mom does to her daughter, Bernice, in the 2004 film Spanglish, starring Adam Sandler. New clothes! But those new clothes come with a catch. Eight? Come on, listen. You are gonna lose that weight. In the film, it's the housekeeper who comes to the rescue. Fits. <laughs> but not before Bernice has a few words with mom. Your gift is a ruse. What outfit does she buy? what they're comfortable in, what they feel beautiful in. And that wasn't happening. So I had to say something. Oh, I'm <laughs> glad you said something too.